hello, it is indeed I, the P.M. Seymour. Ha 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 ha, bibbly booled, you been April fooled. Okay, now let us do the compilation. Enters with a bad PowerPoint animation effect. Here comes the money! Hello. Stretching isn't enough. I need to be able to disassemble my body like Legos. Brain, why, why, why do we want a chicken and cheese quesadilla from Taco Bell? We, we do not like the chicken and cheese quesadilla from Taco Bell. What was wrong with you? I think I can actually answer that. Um, it's weird to say, but I believe that is your body's way of telling you that you need sodium. And what better source than a fast food joint? I will read Dungeon Meshi at an appropriate pace, I thought. It has been two days, and I am at chapter 80. How did this happen? I mean, to be fair, it's, it's got, like, everything. It's got food, it's got anime, it's got monsters, it's got pro ZD, it's got lesbians. What was that last part? Pro ZD? Okay. I am so glad Gunsharov happened when it did. Right before prolific public use of AI. That was pure, honest gaslighting straight from the heart. Real human whimsicality and trickery through blood, sweat, and tears. We were a family. And we all gunched together. You can't replace that with any machine. I didn't even like the Gunsharov meme, and I agree with this. Please enjoy these photos of cows that have been shampooed and blow-dried because I didn't realize this was even possible until today. <sighs> oh my god, look at them. The perfect. The spit take I just did. The menacing aura that is Barack Obama. Well, uh, this is your last chance. If you, uh, don't do the next Mega Mega Binge, I'm, uh, I'm gonna end you. Reminder. You belong to this world. You are made by it and will return to it once your time has come. Live your life. It is yours. Enjoy your time. We all belong here. We all love and hate and die. Make it matter. Be kind. Math is really tiring. I'm so glad I finally get to relax and do some knitting and crochet and I- Oh god, oh my god, what the fuck?! Before you start knitting slash crochet, you have to ask yourself, Do I know how to count? More importantly, am I ready to come to terms with the answer? Which is no. Ghostbusters taking over, I'm virgin! Posts like this made me realize I have never read anyone's fucking URL. For those of you listening, allow me to fix that for you. For female Ghostbusters, the feminists are taking over! I'm an adult virgin! What are we gonna play through some scandal here on Tumblr? Kind of annoyed at the YouTubes having all the fun. So like how YouTube got like a four hour video by H Bomber Guy, do we get someone who does like a hundred page essay? My hobbies include knowing and being right. You would not believe your knees if 10,000 angry bees were released in your room as you fell asleep. <laughs> hey y'all, you know how like internet searches suck now? When the results are awful, full of AI, death of the internet levels are bad, start appending date constraints to your searches, like, quote, before 2023, end quote. My results have gone from 90% AI bullshit to 60% usable, which frankly at this point is a huge improvement. Hey, what if we had a plagiarism scandal here on Tumblr? Kind of annoyed at the YouTube, he's having all the fun. You can't do this to my post. All right, here's today's controversial post. A good amount of you on here will be like, English was my favorite subject, and then reblog posts like, here's why sex scenes can't have symbolism, and stop consuming media with toxic characters. Like, okay, so what were you doing in your English class then? Because it apparently wasn't learning or analyzing. I'm pretty sure it was doodling pictures of eyes. You have no idea how much it annoys me that the idea of creating a terrible character means you're in support of those decisions. No. This is writing an antagonist or a character that gives you motivation to support the protagonist in their cause to do the things. Ayo, fuck personality tests. Reblog this with the position you sleep in and how you like your eggs cooked. People reblogging this with on my back and hard boiled are to be feared. I'm just gonna say right now, side sleeper and scrambled. Holy hell. My upcoming fanfic already reached 5k words and it's not even close to finished. This was supposed to be a one-shot.
One time, one of my teachers referred to me by my Discord name. Jesus Christ, okay, fuck whatever I was talking about. Your thing is a hundred times worse. Anyone else feel like God is just toying with you however he pleases? He thinks he's so funny. Well, I'm about to be hilarious. If you're familiar with the Oath of Love Paladin, you luckily know that their oath is, as do I, never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna run around and desert you, never gonna make you cry, never gonna say goodbye, and never tell a lie and hurt you. Hey, wait a minute! The way The Hobbit is written is so interesting because it's obviously a story-telling style while also being an account of what Bilbo wrote down himself in his red book. So it's just a full-on unreliable narrator, because the narrator can be either the nebulous author translator or Bilbo's sneaky little lies. So basically anything and nothing in The Hobbit could have happened and leaves so much room for fan authors I'm going crazy over it. And narrator-wise, reading The Hobbit, there's so many little notes about how Bilbo thinks he's a great deal more eloquent than he is. It's, it's, but who wrote that? What is the storyteller? Is it self-deprecation on Bilbo's part? Which parts of the story did he over or undersell? How truthful is anything in it? What did he leave out? Oh my god, is this, is this how the movie series can get away with so many creative liberties? Uh, writing prompt. You have vampiric blood running through your veins. However, that blood comes from quite a few generations back. So all it really means is that you like eating meat, can't swim, get mildly annoyed by religious architecture, and get sunburned really easily. Babe, that's... that's just the Irish. In futuristic sci-fi stories, do you think that with all this crazy tech, we as humans fixed Earth's orbit and rotation? So that we don't, we don't have a leap year, we just changed Earth's orbit to match the 24 hour, 365 day movement? I'm sure there's catastrophic reasons why we can't do that. I'm sorry for not mentioning bogs, swamps, mires, and murky waters lately. It'll probably happen again. I'm so mentally stable, you can park a horse in my brain. Bestie, I fear this is something not someone stable would say. Everything should cost $1, $10, or $100. A drinky drink is $1, a t-shirt is $10, rent is $100. I might be convinced to allow $1,000 for some very big purchases like a house. I get it. You're running a business. I'm not unreasonable. Imagine if there was a case of Pokemon adopting, taking a kid. Like a kid just being protected by a bunch of powerful Pokemon. You could tell this is a brain rot idea. Hey. Oral, I don't, I don't know how to tell you this, but the Pokemon TV series? They did that, like, way back in, like, 1999. <sighs> Women. I love thermodynamics because it's like, no, my toaster waffle did not get cold. It simply tried to warm this big cold world all by its little self. Her heat was given, and she asked for nothing in return. One time I dreamt Gravity Falls and Homestuck were made by the same guy. I don't... I don't even have a joke that would be appropriate for YouTube for that. Characters who are absolutely convinced down to their bones that they are unlovable being subjected to the mortifying ideal of being holy and unconditionally loved. Dates the good stuff. Never get tired of it. Not they did nothing wrong, or they're a horrible bastard, but a secret third thing. They did things wrong, and I like that about them, but everyone over-exaggerates their negative impact on the story. I feel like this is how the internet reacted to Mabel Pines, because God forbid she did an irrational thing at 12 years old. What's wrong, babe? You barely touched your... ...brinkles. Yes, your world building is thorough, your geography meticulous, your plotting elaborate, and your characterization nuanced. But answer me this. Is there a fucked up little guy? My girlfriend is turning 32 soon. I've told her not to get her hopes up. After all, I say, we're only going to celebrate it for half a minute. When she asked what in the world I was talking about, I pointed out, this is your 32nd birthday. Jeff, we really... You really gotta change your URL. 
thesaurus.com. Save me. Aid me. Assist me, thesaurus.com. How the fuck do I have gifted kid burnout? I was an art kid. I guess it's fair to say it's just kid burnout. Oh no! Water is pretty nice to drink despite how horribly it treated the crew of Edmund Fitzgerald. Moderation in all things. S someone said that. Guys, my light motif is about to fucking reprise. In, in, in its original major key, right? In its original major key, right? <clears throat> Ladies, lads, gentle thems, you can now drink mayonnaise. Rejoice, white people. Removed an ancient legacy piece of code that provide roughly a one in million chance of catastrophic engine failure at any time for no reason. Railroad is not a highway. Added more strawberries. Not on the highway, mind you. Maybe. Possibly. We don't know. Fixed an issue that caused survivor's face to distort when being hooked by a survivor of the opposite gender. Just imagining that one survivor going, Sorry, I didn't expect to be saved by a woman. Increased odds of meat room. Yummy. Or are you just alone, staring at your screen right now, with not one blade of grass to touch in the vast desert that is isolation and solitude? So, so what, what, what was the patch note? Touch some grass by participating in the St. Patrick TLE in all green cars. So how does that work? Like, because if you don't wear green clothes, you get the pinch. So if you're like in like a non-green car, do they just hit you with a car? Removed. Geomes. For good. Moth person. Serpent. Gray alien world war event. Skrillex NPC. The moon. And Shrek cryptid. No. No! Wait a minute, I think I read this one. Guess I did it twice. Field chance of sting is very low. Granny won't offer you coffee if you have a prison tattoo. Grandma, why? I thought I was your little bubble. Huh? Kicking Shiokawa school is no longer allowed, you hooligan. Probably fixed a bug causing the game to crash when the changelog contains text. Now you can once again bask in the glory of those super long change notes. Yay! All praise Archanim for spending the past hour trying to fix this poor arch. I'm actually the one writing this. There is an issue under certain circumstances whereby the quest guidance icon for the objective cut the meat in the world quest, a dish beyond mortal ken, will float. Travelers who encounter this issue can try using characters to attack the quest indicator icon as a temporary fix. If the issue persists, travelers can report the issue through the feedback tab in the Paimon menu. So how many primo gens did you guys get for that? August 5th, patch notes. Fix bug regarding sword unsheathing. Re-added the ability to pet corrupted friend drones. You could at least try and humanize them. We see you pushing them into the blue drone vets. Fix the ability deactivate deactivating floor traps. And fix player's immunity to friendly fire. Have fun. Hang... Hangy. Briarhorn Hatchling has been struck by the curse of the flesh and is now properly beast type. Was mechanical type for some reason. Biddly bop, you done fucked up. Me? I am a normal girl who has normal thoughts all ye time. They should give me landmines. Petition to start doing reboots of popular shows, but instead of original endgames, it's the most popular ships that become canon. <gasps> oh my god. Would Pokemon Season 1 finally do the thing? DM. The platypus attacks you. Player. I block their attack. Y you mean? Yes. I parry the platypus. Ah, ah, he said it! He said it! As important as explicit gay rep is, nothing will ever be funnier to me than an entire fandom collectively deciding a relationship between these two characters is gay without even a shred of subtext. This post is indeed about Tom Nook and Red's divorce. I'm not showing signs of mental illness. I'm hiding them very well, actually. I don't understand, Sonic. Why didn't he just use his skills at being fast to hurt Eggman until he dies? Hedgehogs have no understanding of the concept of death, so the thought of killing Eggman never occurs to him. Catholic guilt. 
The research teams mumble satisfactorily and deploy food pellets for the two of you. Oh, yeah. Came back Wong from the ghost he stole. Forgot something. <gasps> My onk is... Massive news for linguist! The Sphinx of Black Quartz has just befriended the quick brown fox and the lazy dog. Hooray. Well, if he's your man, then why is he my thematic parallel, hmm? There's a knight in my backyard stabbing the ground with his sword trying to render my sorrel barren by killing the worms, but luckily I've trained them all in classical ballet and they keep pirouetting away from the blade. You know, you can't get sentences like this anywhere else. One time I dreamt Matt Pat stole my car to sell drugs. Well, he's taking retirement well. Is this like the seventh secret ending? <laughs> Why are you following the boobs and ass artist? Why do you think I'm following the boobs and ass artist? Do you think I go to the grocery store ironically too? Can you can you please reblog your boobs and ass artist? Fear of God in my heart seeing this notification. You know, Tumblr should have a specific button that goes, I wanna see posts like this, but not the same one for the next fifty days. On the contrary, I want a button that lets you see the same post for fifty days. How do people read big fanfics in like two days? Insomnia. ADHD. Depression. Hey guys, press F to horse. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I don't care if you skip story cutscenes, even though you're missing half the experience, like whatever. But if you then turn around and complain that the game doesn't make any sense, I sentence you to 10,000 years in the acid fire death pit. I am looking at you, Arnold Warnold Hanson Manson. I'm a woman in the same way a tomato is a fruit. For New York import tax purposes? U.S. Americans really do love making posts about parking lots. I met God in a parking lot, fighting my ex in a parking lot. It's like the main biome. Have you been to America? Yes, it is. What is this teepee holder? <laughs> Pissyfus. So cool that when I say hi to a cat and they do a big stretch, like, I don't think that has anything to do with the words I just said to you, I said, but I think it's awesome that you got along. Water is so tasty and tastier than any of your foolish monster drinks. This is so true, I'm sorry. This vlog is sponsored by Big Water now. Let's just show that when I say Big Water, I don't mean like Nestle or any company of the sort. I mean like the looming ancient gods known as the Water Towers. Kill me once. Shame on you. Kill me twice. How did you do that? Kill me three times. This time loop fucking sucks. Oh god, I'm getting killed the fourth time! Holy crap. I just remembered. I can tame bones. Sometimes fiction doesn't have a moral to the story. Sometimes fiction points at something and goes, Ever thought about that? And you look at what it's pointing at, just for, for a bit. I'm like, oh! Okay then. Me, chat, what do we think? The angel and the devil on my shoulders. Can, can you, you not, not call, call us that, that please? please? Uh, it's always inherited trauma and never inherited gothic castle in the Transylvanian mountains. Ugh. They are called like smaller viruses trying to make it to the big leagues of virus fame. D d yes. Call out post where it becomes more and more obvious that the person writing the call out has a massive crush on the problematic individual. Ah, Jolene. Yo, I forgot I had boobs and was in for the fright of my life when I looked down. This is why they start with BOO, I think. Investing at seven notes. What if dark matter is just wrinkles in the fabric of space-time because no one has ever ironed it? Huh. I don't know how I feel about that. This is the hill you want to die on? Oh no, I just love arguing. I fully intend to leave this hill once it gets boring. Sorry for the confusion. Alternatively, this isn't the hill I want to die on, it's the hill I want to kill you on. Actually, you know what? A nut zero information post teaches you a concept that others believe, or maybe that you would have believed, but isn't true. There's information there. It's like learning trivia, but instead of telling others, you can correct them if they have an incomplete understanding. For those of you that need clarification on what a nut zero information post is, may I recommend... The Tumblr post about the guy on Vine that would climb around Charlotte's flowers in his head and he'd keep seeing my berries. The post claimed that he was a CIA plant put on Vine to track down leftist activists. <laughs> Who decided that dragons have arms? They, they don't need them. Dragons need arms to hug. God damn it, you're right. Now hold it. 
If they're like a serpent dragon, they could hug you by just wrapping around you. And honestly, that sounds that sounds way better. Dude, lesbian orc bars would be crazy. Not gonna lie, when I read bars, I wasn't thinking of the place where you drink and hook up. I was picturing lesbian orcs rapping, and I still thought, so true. Well, it's open mic night at the lesbian orc bar. Lesbian orc bards at the lesbian orc bar? Is this anything? Not gonna name names, but some of you are sweet and kind and deserve the world that I'm rooting for you. Damn. Toskarin, what's what's your job? I operate the terrible machine. Can you make it a little less terrible? Only lever I can pull makes it worse, but I'm doing it slowly because I believe in change from inside the system. Hell yeah. One time I dreamt I was watching some video and they said, Well, you know what they say, a cameraman can grift twice, but a camera can only grift once. And I spent the rest of the dream trying to figure out what the fuck any of that meant. Recipes will be like, prep time, three minutes. And the ingredient list is like, two sweet potatoes peeled and diced. Like, girly, they don't, they don't come like that. Recipes will be like, cook potatoes until soft, about five minutes. Baby doll, you are on bath salts right now. Uber driver who, when you eat in their car, reaches behind the seat and does the dad hand thing. You know what I'm talking about. And honestly, my driver did that. I give them something. They're driving me home. Perceive with your eye spheres. The great eared nightjar. Th this is a dragon. How is it possible for an animal to resemble a bird, a mammal, and a reptile simultaneously? Those are great ears. They didn't even show off their insane mouth. <laughs> <laughs>